All right, guys, so welcome to a game called Potentia. I really don't know too much about this one. The devs were nice enough to send me a key, and it looked really interesting. From the screenshots that I've seen, it looks like a third-person post-apocalyptic survival game. And from those screenshots, it looks like it's been heavily influenced by things like The Last of Us and the other survival games which you guys would have heard and which you'll see when we're playing. Anyway, I thought we'd jump in and just see what the game is like as it is. I'm expecting it to be a little bit rough around the edges, but like I say, with those screenshots and a little bit of the gameplay, I think this could be interesting. So here we go with some potential. There was a mood of celebration in the city and everybody seemed to be happy. The war was over. There we go. Objective, go to the subway. The fireworks are going. The streets are alive. The war is over. I don't really know what caused the war yet. Clearly, we're going to get into all of that stuff. Yeah, people just vibing. Some street dancers. Episode 1, A Beautiful Day. Is he one of those uh, street magicians? Oh, wait. Oh, this poor guy. Wait. <laughs> he looks eerily like <laughs> John Wick. <laughs> what are you doing down there, John? All right, let's keep it moving. Balloons. Enter the station. Yeah, I just arrived at the station. The train should be about almost here. Where are you now? Sit I'll meet you here. Hurry! Okay, I'm on my way. What's the hurry for, anyway? Okay, so we gotta head down here. We're meeting someone? I guess that's why we're, uh, we're getting the train. We gotta get to a destination, meeting some... Use assistant view to use destination need to go. Uses ATP. The assistant view also shows you objects you can interact with. Oh, okay. So we hold it and it gives us a marker of where to go. Again, this is... I haven't seen any of this. This must, like, predate everything that happens. Because of the screenshots and videos and even the gameplay that I saw... It was absolutely post-apocalyptic setting. Like, stuff was all run down, overgrown, and there was people around carrying heavy weapons and stuff. This has none of that. It says that we have to read read the newspapers. All right, I guess that's going to tell us more about the war then. These guys rocking some Hawaiian shirts and flip-flops. Why not, right? Why not? Where is this thing? Oh, there we go. Newspaper vendor. Somebody over there just on his phone. Areas where this logo is located contain information about the story. Okay, let's get it then. Strategy today. Peace. The war is over. Negotiations that has been going on for several weeks surprisingly reached a positive conclusion. Although no details were made public. It's been heavily hinted that an armistice was signed and a peace agreement is currently in works. We all remember last months have been tense. Due to casualties caused by enemy raids on the northern border. A report titled Northern Border Strategic Report was published. Okay, so is it is it just countries at war with each other then? Turn into a full-blown war. After enemy air raids behind our borders, artillery strikes were called on enemy forward positions in retaliation. Okay, cruise missiles upon each other. Yeah, it looks like we've just got nations at war. After the incident, Department of Defense finished building shelters in three weeks as a response to the threat of a devastating nuclear war. Nobody wants that. What's going on? These guys arguing? Have you got any idea who you're talking to? Look at these medals. I didn't know them for my word puzzle skills. Is your brain filled with spaghetti? <laughs> I was fighting for you when you were shooting ducks with a super soccer. And look at what people think I deserve. A quarter. Maybe I should have worked at an ice cream shop instead of making sure that those assholes stay where they are. I would be rich by now. Go away, idiot. I'm not taking your money even if you stuck it to my mouth. I don't understand. What? I just wanted to help. Calm down. Here, take it. No more problems, okay? What are you doing? 
I need that for my list to track that. It's been hard times lately. Okay. Uh, you see worse, Victor. What just happened? This poor guy stood up and then started having a, a confrontation with someone about how he's. I think he, this might. This guy might be a veteran or something. And he didn't want to take money from somebody because. I guess he might have been too proud. And then he took a picture of us because we gave him cash. And he took the picture because he remembers his debts or something like that. What? <laughs> Your guess is as good as mine. No idea. I mean, I feel really sorry for him. He kind of looks like he's in combat gear too. Knee pads and stuff like that. All right, where are we going to go? Wait for the train. <laughs> I did not expect this. I thought we'd get thrown into something like immediate action of survival, you know? Like we were traveling in a convoy or something like that. This is completely different. Let's take the escalators. You can hear the train coming as well. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. All right, so we've got to get into the... No, 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 no. Yep, yeah, no, no, yeah. I don't even need to say it. I don't even need to say it. I just wanted to have a little bit of a look around about what's going on. War is over. Our citizens are celebrating peace. As I say, ideas are welcome. This guy trying to break into the vending machine. These ladies just having a chat. Seems pretty peaceful. Like the tensions are over. The war's finished. The only thing I can think of whenever I see red balloons is just Pennywise. Is it anyone else? <laughs> I don't like looking at red balloons anymore. Oh. Oh no, something's about to go down, isn't it? That ominous sound. There we go. I heard an explosion. Oh my god! been thrown from the car at least we thought it was so the war isn't over oh my what the fuck is going on here that is exactly what i was just thinking find anna what just happened to those people they melted Okay, this is taking a twist. So this is what happened then. Is this the beginning of everything going down? Sprint. I need to get an The way outside doesn't look safe. Sight of those rats! I, I hate rats. Oh no 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 no, get away from the rats. People should have passed out like me. All these peace talks were bullshit. Peace but talks are bullshit. Like <coughs> okay, let's get through this. Crouch. Oh, there's somebody there. Gonna help them? May need to crouch. Wait, they keep dis- What is this? They keep just evaporating. What kind of weapon is that? And why are we immune to it? Let's just go. Let's go. Another person just disappeared. We are taking damage here. Let's just keep it moving then. I should hurry. Anna may be in danger. I don't know who Anna is. Maybe that's who we were trying to get to while we were in the uh, the train station. 
It's kind of weird playing a third person style game. We've been playing first person for so long. A little more. Just a little more. A little further down. Get away from all that debris. Oh Look at the size of those things. She's alive. Two trains. so weird the way they just like dissolve we were wrong yeah, someone was wrong in a big way three years later okay this this is what i saw Definitely got that apocalyptic feel. Look at that. The overgrown, broken down vibe that you can see. I think this is where the adventure begins. Walkie talkie. I thought you stopped making shitty jokes. Here we go. We're in. Oh yeah, I'm definitely getting that Last of Us vibe. I mean, only really because of the way the city is and stuff. I guess the outfit too, a little bit with the bed. Find the market. Okay, so we do one of these. And then everything is over there. Oh, we can find other stuff too. Question marks. I guess the main objective in the top right there. Find the market. That's what we've uh, wow. we got to find. Worse than the last time I was here. Don't waste our time. I doubt there's anything left for your level. These ravages are quick to spot free sample areas. Maybe some mice or insects. And denosine triphosphate. By the way, why did you eat the dog going out? I just wanted someone to take care of the children, in case. I keep thinking about the same thing. What's going on everywhere else? You know, we close that subject. Okay, so he's trying to give a little bit of a backstory as what's going on. I'm going to be honest, the voice acting isn't the best. You need a climbable object. Interaction indicator will appear showing you the climb button. I don't know. A mysterious ultra-classified airport. And damn, we got hot. We should give it a shot. Oh, crowbar. Crowbar is used as a melee weapon. The equipment is your best helper to survive. Numeric keys are Q to open. Okay, so we got an inventory wheel. Nice. God damn, that is one massive crowbar. Right, let's climb. What's this? Today we finished container area. We have selected the most quiet part of the city to build that shelter. However, one week ago we heard a gunshot. Are we safe? I do not know, Andrew. Okay, so people are leaving diaries around. Very cool vibe it's got going on. I like this style. You guys know that by now, though. Got ourselves a pistol. Semi-automatic, medium range. That's a Beretta, right? Let's see. Yeah, we got ourselves a Beretta. Reload it. Reload everything up. Nice. At least we got a weapon. I mean, we have the crowbar, but... How do we put this away? H. There we go. We can holster it. Grab... So I guess this is just kind of the early stages, just learning everything. How the mechanics of the game work. Again, though, this whole vibe of things have been boarded up, they put... I don't know what that was. They've just put things in the areas, like, to, to kind of restrict the flow of people coming through. So you have to use whatever you can to kind of maneuver around the objects. I've always loved that vibe. I <laughs> just noticed we're pushing a massive fridge. Ideally, what I really want to get with this is 
a picture of if there is a gem underneath it. A lot of games start out this way, where it's so raw, like there's a lot of things that need polishing up and they run down the line. Once they do that, as long as they've got that core backbone to the game, I'm pretty sure it can turn into something everyone can enjoy. Constantly going to be checking on the top of those rooftops, making sure there's no snipers. I love that. A whole graffiti thing on the wall there. I love that style. All right, let's see where we got to go. Still find the market. So over in that general direction. Oh, some people dead. Oh, there's people over there too. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Oh no. Shot them. That was the gunshots we heard, wasn't it? No, we don't. I will get that damn market today. But I have a different priority right now. Damn right you do. Let's see. I always love these kind of things when you go behind someone like that and you can do like a little silent takedown. Oh, that's nice! Oh, okay. So we flipped him over our head. And then... Twisted that neck right round. Got the neck crank going. That's all she wrote. There's somebody else down there too. Oh, you can get in these. Open. It's all been blocked off. As I say. I like this house. It used to belong to my father. I'm sick and probably last long. If you're reading this message, I left a surprise for you in the kitchen. Good luck, Martin. No, check near the fridge. Okay. So did this belong to our father or was this just again another journal from someone or a diary, I guess? Some ammunition in the oven. Of course there is. The only place you should keep your ammunition. Some more just left on the seat. Was that where the fridge was? Yeah, okay. So it was in that drawer. Oh, look at that. That's a cool little effect. Do you guys see that? The sun rays coming through. Like the dust, because this hasn't been lived in. I don't know if we've kicked that dirt up, but I like that. Those soft little touches. Give you that apocalyptic feel. Didn't actually think we could go into the buildings yet. I thought it was really early on. It's all boarded up, though. Some chairs. More pistol ammunition. Now, this strikes me as something where a sniper would be posted. Got good access from the windows. Just giving some overwatch. You can see quite a good angle on either side. That's where I'd be. Either that or on top of the roof. RAK regenerates some of your health and ATP immediately upon usage. Okay, so the bottom left corner there. ATP seems to be this ability that we're using. Which I don't quite fully understand. I don't know how we've got that. We had that while we was at the station too. I don't know if it's like a mutation or if it's some kind of technology or something like that. I really don't know. I hope it gets explained. Oh! <gasps> I'm going to wait for that one to go. If you turn around, go past that container, and you're mine. Oh, the back of the knees! Oh, and the back of the head, too! Pistol rounds. I do really like the takedowns. Oh, where did this other one go? Oh, here we go. You don't see anything. That's perfect. Back of the knees again. Oh, I really do like that. I'm a big fan of that. More pistol ammunition. They both just disappeared. <laughs> the world was always the same. All people needed was an excuse. That's way too real. That's very true, though. Like, in this scenario, you can't really pass judgment on people. I mean, obviously, there's there's good and evil and there's right and wrong, but... All anyone's going to be trying to do when the world goes to shit like this is just survive in their only way they know how. Pistol ammunition. I think seeing as though it's given us a lot of ammunition, we should probably switch to that, right? Oh. There's a doggo. Oh, I didn't even think of that. I don't know if we have, like, a companion, a dog companion. That would be amazing. There needs to be more of that. Aim plus V is push the enemy. Okay, oh. Hmm. 
thought I had something. Baseball bat. Oh, back of the leg. Oh, I'm a big fan of those stealth takedowns. I really am. Just some trash everywhere. Probably where he's been staying. Yeah, this is probably where he was sleeping. There's a crossover. Is that where we're gonna get to? Oh no, it's around that way. So these little question marks down there as well, I can actually go to them and pick things up. I'm guessing it's like ammunition, maybe different tools or weapons and stuff. If I'm close to any of them, I will check them out. Down the stairs. All right, let's just go. Don't want to be crouching everywhere. I used to have a friend living here. We did? I never saw him again after the incident. Okay, so what was the incident though? I mean... Was it just somebody rain hellfire down on where we're living, or is there like a, a different type of weapon or something? Because people don't just disintegrate. I mean, they do, but very specific weapons, and we were totally fine. So it looked like some kind of advanced technology that they were using. Oh, there's somebody there. I don't know if it's just me as well. I love this look. Like when when developers use this look. The whole, like, mercenary style thing. The jeans, the vest, the hoodie underneath. Look at that. It's got a leg holster. Looks really cool. Oh, over the shoulder again. And the neck crank. And there we go. Lights out. Oh, we got grenade. Pistol ammo, grenade. Let's go back this way. Let's see what's over here. Yeah, I'd really want to know if, like, if that was some kind of particular weapon or anything like that. Because things are just not adding up right now. We've got this weird ability where we can sense things. Which I don't know what it reminds me of as well. If, if anybody knows, let me know what this is. It reminds me of a particular game that I've played before. I just cannot for the life of me remember it. I do love this though. The fact that we can just take him down. No end. Oh, this way. It doesn't look like there's anything. Oh, that's where we just were. There's a tent over there too. Yeah, I don't think... G, hold it and release it when you select your target. Oh, there we go. We got a barrel. Oh, we didn't even pull the pin. <laughs> we did all that with one hand. Oh, damn. Okay. So we can throw grenades too. We don't have any left, but I don't know why I did that. It better give me another grenade. <laughs> Just used it for a tutorial. I shouldn't have done it. What's this? Pistol ammo. Okay, we can't climb up there. So you can't freely jump as well. I guess it's only when you get the instruction to. Don't know how I feel about that. I like the freedom to be able to have that mobility to move around. Pistol ammo, we'll take it. Don't know why it's doing in the cooler or in the fridge, but we're not going to ask any questions. Some more ammunition and an RAK or a wreck. Like a, uh, a med kit or something like that. My god, that is a huge till. <laughs> I think the scaling needs a little bit of work too, but again, all that stuff can come in time. Some of the god rays poking through. Mag... Magnot? Soda? I can't get anything yet. It's all been broken into. People have taken what they can get. There's nothing. Let's switch to the pistol. Just in case. We'll load it up. Let's just reload it. We've got a crane over there. Which way we got to head? Yeah, he's telling me to go back that way. Maybe it's round or something? Broken down cars... See, stuff like this, hey, see how this is a choke point? I love that. It's like it's fit for purpose or something. X, oh. X, you can get the attention of any by whistling nearby. They almost walked out in front of him. Might be a little bit too far away. I'm going to wait for this guy to go, and then I'm going to try and bring him. Oh, there's three of them. I want to take him down quiet, so... See, I want to know, though, if I bring one of them close, if I do one of those, like, takedowns, if it uses the pistol. Shit. They're here. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, yeah, he's coming. Oh, I do like that a lot. Oh, here? no, 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 no. Who is that?
When he turns around, I'm gonna get him. What? Is there anyone here? Stop, stop, stop. That's perfect. And... You're mine. Back of the knees. And lights out. What have you got? It wasn't car- Okay. Time to switch to a pistol. We're going loud. I thought I got a headshot on one of them. Damn, they got like vests on or something? Again, I don't know if you guys have caught this from the character, but there's something that's really distracting. <laughs> on his right wrist, he's wearing like a bracelet and it's wiggling. I love the fact that it wiggles, but like this. Sometimes when I was firing, there you go, you can see it. Like <laughs> it wiggles, it catches my eye. I think he's thinking it's somebody running across my screen. Some more ammunition. And we're okay for health, too. They didn't tag us too hard. I guess they were just patrolling this area for making sure nobody gets through. Close to the supermarket or something. You got in the back. Oh, there we go. Pistol ammo. You guys have to admit, that looks amazing. That whole feel. I mean, I'm very biased. Because <laughs> I love stuff like this. It's part of the reason why I love The Last of Us. They did it so well. They really did. I mean, this isn't bad. It's not bad at all. Right. I was going to switch my shoulder. No, let's stay this side. <whistles> Too far away. Might have to go... Oh, wait a second. <laughs> he knew! All right, let's go loud. Headshot. Headshot. Another one. Line him up. Can't get it. There we go. Nobody this side. Oh, we're okay. We handled that pretty well. Can't loot any of the vehicles. Yeah, there's nothing really much to take. There's a lot of these guys, but I don't quite know what they would got. Oh, he's got a respirator on. Give me that. There we go. There's a tower there. Can we actually get to that? Because you can imagine... There might be a sniper rifle or a shotgun or an assault rifle or something that we can use. It just doesn't look like there's a way through. Yeah. It's all kind of leading me this way. Let's just keep it going. I got my pistol. I'm a crowbar. That's all I need. Shopping trolley. Can we, can we push it or climb in it or anything? <laughs> I don't know why. Just, just check it everything at this point. Break this game open. See what it can and can't do. Oh, yeah, we got Bob. Oh, hello. No. Grab the pistol. Oh, damn, you got a good shot on me then. Oh, yeah, you definitely hurt. Heal up. Stick that thing straight into the torso and it heals up. You can see where you hit the person as well. Was you just around here? Reload up. Yeah, I think this is where you were posted, wasn't it? Grenade. Ammunition and health kit. Full health, two grenades. There should be plenty of ammunition too. Swap the shoulders. Oh, there's two towers there. I want to get up to them though. And oh, we're good. What is this? Yeah, it just looks like the area's flooded then. For a second, it looked like it was just a swimming pool in the middle of nowhere, like in the middle of the streets, but it's not. It's just flooded. This whole area's overgrown too. And it doesn't look like anything's up there or anyone is keeping watch up there. I saw there was a little symbol over next to one of these things. Oh, there we go. Grab it. Push it. Climb up anywhere. Yeah, we can't break those open. Climb on the container. There we go. Yeah, we've got to come across one of those towers at one point. See, it'd be really nice if we can break into these windows as well and kind of take a shortcut through... through the buildings. I think that'd be real nice. I mean, I guess there's a reason behind you not doing that. <laughs> they want you to follow a particular route. Because that's how the storyline progresses, but... It's a little bit more freedom. I think it'd be nice. Anna, I'm right behind the market. We're all clear, Anna. Seems so. Switching off. I'll get out as soon as possible. 
Switching off. Oh, we're here. Okay, this is the market. The store. So there's stuff over that way too. Let's go and check that out first. Yeah, this is the uh, this is the supermarket. All those containers blocking off that way. Not taking any chances. There is something round here though. There we go. What's this? Ammunition. Another health pack. We can't carry it though. Someone's boarded up the tents. Watch out. Fuck. They're here. Let's heal up before we go in. Who shouted watch out? <laughs> they didn't sound worried. Oh, I can't climb on that. I keep forgetting that I can't climb on things. Grenade, it's just a grenade on the shelf. Nice. Supermarket's been picked been picked clean. Let's see if we can get a takedown on him. Yeah, let's see what happens when we got the pistol. Oh, he switches to the crowbar. I love that though. And there we go. Give me that. I want your pistol ammo. Oh, I caught the back of somebody. This there we go. Center aisle. I wonder if I whistle what will happen. What? No! No! Don't do it! There we go, go down. Nice. Right, switch. Pistol. Let's get low. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Gotta get low, get low. Hit that stim. Oh my god, I'm out. Surrounded. Surrounded. Let's try and get a little bit of distance. Now I'm gonna fuck your Wait, what did he say? <laughs> what were you gonna do? Oh, they keep getting some real nice shots. He's causing like a knockback. Heal up. Oh my god, the music. <laughs> it's so intense. Can't go down. Oh my god! No! Is that it? We're out of wrecks. Need something we can heal with. These guys actually, they do hit hard. I mean, you can see that. There we go. Heal up. We were able to hold our own, though. <laughs> that went south. Real quick. <laughs> Just turned the corner, we're trying to get a stealth kill. And then she turned around last second and it messed everything up. They're all down though, right? Pistol ammunition. I mean, you can see it though. There's definitely something there. What's this? That's one of those racks, isn't it? There's definitely something there with this. Like, I can see where they could improve. I mean, the voice acting. Definitely feels, the movement feels a little bit too stiff. Everything just needs tightening up a little bit. Oh, there we go. Shotgun. Pump action. Short range. Very high. Damage. Capacity weapon. Carries four shells. Nice. So we got something that can hit a lot harder up close range now. Oh, damn. He's carrying all the equipment. Look at that. Full face helmet. And he's got a shotgun by the looks of it. Either that or it's an SMG. What is that? Can't quite tell. It might have been an MP5 or something. Find the exit. All right, well, we did that, and I think this is the next point where we start venturing a little bit deeper into this city, but I think this is where we're going to end it. I don't quite know what you guys are going to think of this. I mean, if I'm being totally honest, the voice acting needs to be changed. Things need to be a little bit tighter, like the cinematics. Just everything needs to be just a little bit quicker, a little bit snappier. The music, I like the music. It's not too bad, the ambient sounds and stuff like that, but oh, hello. Oh yeah, he's not to be messed with. I don't think I can get a headshot on him with that helmet on. I'm really tempted. I want to know what happens. I'm just going to run him. One. Oh my god. Two. Three. Four. Oh no, we're going to reload. And the epic music kicks in. One. Go down. No. Got to heal. Got to heal. 
Reload, Victor! Quick! Oh, oh. oh you gotta go down! You got to go down! I'm out of racks. Gotta That's all she wrote. He's down. Holy shit, that was close. Give me that. Just nice. Everywhere, right? Okay, whatever you well have done. on. Heading back. That armor that you're wearing, we definitely need that. And I want that full face helmet. I want your shotguns, your knee pads, nah, everything. They already took everything. No need to come here again. I'm coming back. Look at that, the gas station that's all overgrown too. God, that looks so good. Okay, I think this is where we're going to end it then. There's a tank over there too. I don't know. If you guys are into this, we can definitely do a little bit more and see what else the game has. But still really early on, you can see in the top right corner there, work in progress. They're working on things. They're trying to get this where it needs to be. But there we go. That was just a little bit of a look at a game called Potentia. Let me know what you think down in the comments. A little bit rough around the edges. Do you like what you see? I'd love to read what you guys think. So for now, we are going to end it. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support. And I'll see you all in the next one.